Welcome to Pace Studio on the Road. We're here in Nashville at Jan's house. This is presented by our friends at Show X, which gives musicians control over their own ticketing. We're live right now with Oliver Wood. Oliver, everybody, thank you for being here. Thank you. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for having us. This is a beautiful spot. Thank you, Jan, for uh, hosting. And uh, we got a brand new record comes out tomorrow. So we're going to play some songs off it. This is actually an old uh, gospel song. We're going to try to butcher the best we can. fun man thank you guys for coming out to the to the porch here at Jan's house and making this fun thank you thanks for having us yeah so I've been uh, been enjoying the music a lot and congratulations again I mean it's out out in the world tomorrow so thank you for the preview of it right now um, Pleasure. I was reading about the uh, like the creation process about it it's not necessarily you didn't have the most precise control over it I mean it happened in sort of a, a, a chaotic and unpredictable situation in the world and uh, can you talk about some of the upsides of working in uh, in a chaotic and not perfectly controlled environment <laughs> well uh, uh, obviously, we talk about the the pandemic and, and also social upheaval and liberation and um, and all kinds of stuff that went on this last year, and uh, all of it contributes to to not just what I do, but what what we all do. So um, you know, for me, being a touring musician, for us being used to uh, touring a lot and being constantly busy, and then having families at home. Um, it meant uh, having free time and a lot of pent-up energy to put into uh, uh, ultimately cr creative stuff. So, um, but for me, I got to finish a lot of things that, that I started and tried different things that I'm used to doing. You know. 
Nice, and the, the album artwork too, which is cool. I just found out that it was it was your wife that did it, I and mean, that's amazing that, to be able to collaborate that way with a spouse yeah. and do something professionally together like totally. that. It's a very it cool free. design. <laughs> <laughs> well done. It works works on every level. Um, cool, man. Well, uh, the sound check that we got we, we've been treated to for the last hour was wonderful. That first song was wonderful that you just played for the internet, and there's there's Thank more, you. man. What's coming up second? Uh, well, I think we'll do. Um, let's see, I think we'll do uh, the first single, which is called "Fine Line," and uh, it, it's actually a song that dates back to to the, the '90s, I think, with my old band King Johnson. Um, and it's one of those songs that I always wish more people had heard, and that I um, especially just love. Anything playing with these guys is like we can update anything or just, you know, put our own spin on it. So this is uh, an old song, but um, but it's got what it's got. Somebody tell me what's the reason nobody is satisfied. Jump around from one to another Don't you know I guess cold outside at the fine line Between love and lust Between truth and trust Somebody tell me what's the reason Everybody don't play by the rules I guess they just stop believing Today they should have done better It's a fine line Between love and lust Between truth and trust Thank you both. <laughs>
<laughs> Man, dude, these guys, this sounds so good. And we're, um, as as we said before, here at, at Jan's house, and we would be remiss if we came to Jan's house and did not uh, try some of his bourbon library here. And some Russell's Reserve was just poured yeah. today. Um, what yeah. are you guys, what, what are you tasting? How do you like it? Um, what do you think, guys? I'm pretty impressed with the smell. I heard it was delicious. <laughs> dude, I can smell it from here. <laughs> it's really gl glowing in the light. It dude. is. Oh, oh, oh. Now we'll pass it around good. just for one now last. going to be good. Yeah. To be sure, but uh, yeah, Yana's pretty much spoiled us. Yeah. It's pretty great. <laughs> it's really good. It's pretty great. It's pretty inspiring. Nice. Yeah. 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 Man, it's delicious. We've appreciated the hospitality all week. Thank you very much. Um, and we're let's talk about the. Um, I mean, there's a, an amazing cast of characters, musicians on Always Smiling. I mean, some of my very favorite personal artists are on this record. Can you talk about some of the collaborations that that uh, that are found on the record? Yeah. Well, that's the the ironic thing about calling it a solo record is it's really just a series of collaborations. So. Um, but uh, I mean, these two guys are instrumental, literally, in the making of the album. Uh, Jono Ricks on on drums, keyboards, Jono. percussion, um, was a big part of the record. And I play with Jono normally with the Wood Brothers, and and so he and I already have a musical brotherhood. And um, and then Ted Pecchio plays bass on the entire That's record. It. So. Um, and he and I go back to uh, to live when we used to live in Atlanta. We both live in Nashville now, but we've uh, always played together and been been musical nerds and buddies. Uh, but yeah, we have some great guest uh, writers like uh, Chris Long, uh, actually the original vocalist on on the song that we just um, played, uh, as an old bandmate of mine, and um, Carsey Blanton and uh, Susan Tedeschi sings on a song and. Um, Phil Cook was a great collaborator. He and I wrote um, together and, and played some stuff together in the studio. So, is it, you know, for me, it was a cool way to get outside of the Wood Brothers for just because there was time and space to do that and just collaborate with some other people. Cool. Yeah, I caught that uh, the fireside session, the the Tedeschi Tedeschi Trucks fireside session with that co-write that uh, that you did. Oh yeah. With uh, with Susan. So it's, it seems like you've been been busy. Yep. 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 Nice. Um, well, dude, thank you again so much for coming and doing this. And there's more music to be shared. What's happening last today? Yeah, I think we'll finish here uh, with a song called Kindness. This is the first song on the album. And uh, uh, I don't know, after you make an album, what's really fun is to try to see what translates live and how to translate it and, and rethink it. And uh, although it was an interesting process making some of these songs for the album, this one uh, was a really weird one. Um, and so creating it live, we could do whatever we want. So, um, so we're going to do that. It's called, uh, what's it called? Kindness. Yeah. you're giving he said
this way that you're living, he said. For a better condition It was an easy decision Pure intuition Cure for division Who could deny this loving position Come on and try Yo. Man, how cool. Dude, right b before we let you go, could you break down a little bit of what's happening rhythmically in that song? I know for sure that the internet's going to ask if that play between the, the cowbell on the beater and the guitar is just incredible. What's, what's going on there? <laughs> uh, I don't exactly know. I mean, jono has got a cowbell <laughs> hidden down there somewhere that he's playing it with his, uh, his foot. And... Uh, 
What's the secret, guys? I don't know. <laughs> Trying to kill mosquitoes over yeah. here. You know, like. <laughs> and this is the one, that's the one with chicken with chicken coop on it, right? Uh, it does have some chicken coop, yep. Yeah, yeah. I had to double check with our resident uh, drum expert, Andrew. It's like, dude, chicken coop, is this a percussion thing that I'm supposed to know what that is, or are they literally talking about a chicken coop? <laughs> it's a regional, uh, it's a regional thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Now, the recording does have a chick feature a chicken coop, uh, as, um, as well as Jono playing drum. But uh, originally tracked all on chicken coop. I, yeah, originally tracked all on chicken, chicken coop. coop. And I just laid um, drums over it. Right. But uh, yeah, sometimes to adapt, we try to figure out uh, well, who's going to play cowbell? And Jono said, I got a foot over here and he can do it. And, you know, in case you didn't notice, keyboards and percussion and drums all happening in one spot. Well so, done, Jono. So really, that's the mystery. That's the secret weapon. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> nice. Well, man, we've enjoyed this very much. Thanks for coming by, and uh, and best of luck tomorrow. Tomorrow is release day. Always smiling comes out into the world. Thank you for the preview of the music. Man, it's awesome. always good to see you guys. Our pleasure. Thanks for having us. All right. Thank see you next you. time.